If all has gone well during the activation and startup sequence, your Quattro is now in normal operation mode. At this point, it will actively monitor the atmosphere for hazardous conditions and will continually check itself for problems. During normal operation, always be on alert for alarms. If your Quattro detects a hazardous atmosphere or discovers a problem during its continuous self-check, it will give an audible, visual, and vibrating alarm. If you're in a confined space when this happens, exit immediately. Let's briefly go over some of the alarms your Quattro might indicate during normal operation. You must exit a confined space if your Quattro goes into alarm. If your battery life is low, your Quattro will alarm. If your Quattro detects a low or high reading on the TWA or STEL, your Quattro will alarm. The specific sensor that is in alarm will be highlighted in black. The example shown here is a TWA alarm on H2S. If your Quattro detects a reading that is either over or under a sensor's detection range, your Quattro will alarm. Again, the sensor in alarm will be highlighted in black. The example shown here is an over limit alarm on LEL. If your Quattro detects a high or low reading on any of the four gases individually, your Quattro will alarm. The examples shown here are a high alarm on CO and a low alarm on oxygen. If any alarms occur during startup, take your Quattro out of service and contact us. If any alarms occur during normal operation, exit the confined space immediately and take your Quattro out of service and contact us. Read your instruction manual. It has valuable troubleshooting tips, warnings, and procedures. Our video is not a replacement for reading your manual. From all the folks at Major Safety, thank you for making us your go-to resource for all things confined space. Be sure to tell others about us. Visit our website, read our blog, which is loaded with helpful tips and info, and check out our other helpful videos.